Hey, this is Josh from WR Long. Today we're gonna to be talking about how to locate the Power Beyond port on your loader valve. There are two basic types of hydraulic systems. One is open center hydraulic systems. The other is closed center hydraulic systems. Typically on open center hydraulic systems, it's gonna be on tractors 100 horsepower and below. Or on closed center, they're typically gonna be on tractors above 100 horsepower. Today we're gonna to focus on tractors with open center hydraulic systems. There are seven lines connected to your loader valve. Four of these are connected to your loader for the up, down, dump, and curl. The pump provides fluid to your loader valve through the fifth hose, and your loader valve may have the letter P embossed on it near this port. The six hose is connected to your tank line, which is connected to your pressure relief valve that is located in your loader valve. The pressure relief valve is normally set at 2,750 PSI, and this protects your pump from high back pressure or a blocked flow situation created by motors, cylinders, or other valves downstream in your hydraulic system. One example is when the attachment is curled all the way back until the cylinder bottoms out. If the joystick is held in place, the hydraulic fluid has nowhere to go, so the pressure goes up pressure relief valve opens, allowing the fluid to go out the tank line directly to the tank. When the joystick is returned to the home position, the pressure goes back to normal, the pressure relief valve closes, and the fluid is no longer going out the tank line. The seventh hose is connected to the Power Beyond port. When your tractor is working normally, the fluid will enter your loader valve at the pressure port, and then it leaves your loader valve through the Power Beyond port. The Power Beyond port is used to power other valves after or beyond the loader valve. There's a number of ways to identify the Power Beyond port. Many loader valves have the letters PB or BY embossed on the valve. Some valves use what is called a Power Beyond sleeve to activate the Power Beyond port. This simply looks like a nut, but it is thicker than a normal nut, as you can see here. Some tractors have a color-coded system that identifies the Power Beyond port. You can see on this tractor, there is a green mark next to the Power Beyond port. Another way is to trace the hose. Since four of the hoses go to the loader, there are only three other possibilities remaining. The one from the pump is not it. The one to the tank is not it. The one that is connected to another valve on your tractor would be the Power Beyond port. We appreciate you watching our video today. And if you're still having trouble identifying the Power Beyond port, feel free to give us a call. Otherwise, check out our website, and just remember, we're here when you need us.